let's take a look at how to create to-do list in Vue.js. So the first thing, we are on Vue.js page and I'm clicking on getting started page where I can get Vue.js CDN path. So you can copy this and then open text editor where I have just created index.html file with boilerplate text. Here I am pasting the Vue.js CDN path. Next thing, now that we are creating a to-do list, let's start by creating a div and let's name it app, okay? So the focus of our Vue.js will be within this app ID, okay? So this div ID app should contain a list. So let's have a list, okay? So inside this, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna simply add a list of items that basically is just output or items, okay? So once you go through that, you can go ahead and create a script for your view, okay? So let's start with variable app and new view. Okay, so here, what I'm gonna do is I'm going to set an element for our view to work on. Okay, next thing is we also need to create uh, data. Okay, so that data should contain list of items. Okay, so those to-do list items should be have something like this. So let's say uh, add milk, then add sugar, then add tea powder. Okay, so this something like that. And then add, let's say vanilla. Okay, so I'm just adding for the sake of it. Next thing is we also need to put comma after this. And once we do all that, we have to also check out whenever we add our item, it should be displayed here. So for that, we are making use of v-4. Okay, and here I have to simply point to item in items, okay, right? And once you point that out, it should be ready to display your items. Okay, and let's open our page and it should show you your items, something like this, okay? So let's clean this up and make it look good, okay? So first thing that we need to do is, first thing to change is instead of items, we simply type in items so that it can output one to-do list at a time. So add milk, add sugar, and so on, okay? So as you can see, once that is added, we need to add a few more elements such as input form. So make changes more with that you can check out that by replacing items with item, you are displaying one item per list item, okay? After that, let's just create input where we are accepting, let's say, okay, and here, we need to model our input for, let's say, new item, okay? So we have to have one system for that. Uh, also, let's add one button and we have to add something for like add to do item, okay? So let's refresh the page and you have your item right here, okay?
Okay, so we have to add some action here and also have to handle that. Okay, so let's take a look at that. We will add V dash on and then click. Okay, and then point it to a custom method. Let's say add item. Okay, and here I'm going to add that. So let's use, so let's use methods for adding additional methods such as, let's say add item. Okay, and within that we can add our item with this dot items dot push and here inside this I'm going to add this dot new item okay that's it and what we're going to do in here is we simply need to make this a function okay and then remove this, right? And the error will be taken care of as we have made this a method. Also, we have to clean up once the new item is added, okay? So once we add this and also added empty string, it should clear for new items, okay? So let's refresh the page and let's say add chocolate and you get your chocolate added so also uh, let's add a few more items and check if it works so heat for 10 minutes okay as you can see your to-do list is ready to use so this was a short demonstration on how to use Vue.js to create a to-do list.